Wait, I'm gonna need my beanie before we start. This video is sponsored by Taco Bell. I really don't think I need an introduction to this video. I, it's pretty self-explanatory. Let's mess around and see what shinies would look cool for these, these, these fine young lads. And we're just gonna select all of these orangey red colors. Now, okay, so assuming my guess uh, from my previous video where I guess that it's going to become fire electric is true, I'm wondering if maybe just making it slightly more yellow. Already, that looks pretty cool. Right about there. All right, so then what if the color of the bandage and the ear things and his feet thing also changed? I kind of like green. It's like sort of li limey green. What if the color swapped where like the things that were like a yellowy orange, they like switch places with the orangey red stuff. So let's get that like an orangey, an orangey red right about, right about there. If, okay, let's assume, again, that my guess is correct. What if instead of, like, keeping it to that color scheme, they go with something that is just kind of electric by name, by, like, a, like an electric blue? Kind of like, uh... Kind of like th that, about. Yeah, I dig that. You know, blue doesn't even look that bad. It's like a blue bunny, like the ice cream! That's the, wait, that's the ice cream, right? Or is it the butter? Blue bunny... Wait, no, there's Blue Bunny and there's Blue Bell, but wait, Blue Bell is cheese. I don't, fuck, I don't know. I don't eat enough dairy. Purple actually looks really freaking cool. Uh, but I think like a, like a darker blue. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That looks nice. Look at that. That's pretty good. So like, you know, again, my guess is correct. Electric, electric blue. That looks pretty fucking awesome. Of course, it wouldn't be a Spectre video if I didn't experiment with a little bit of purple. Right there. That looks nice. I like purple. Yo, LA, LA Lakers color, represent. Just kidding, I don't, I don't know sports. I just know that that's those colors. I'll always stand by the notion that purple and green is like an amazing color combo. In this situation, I don't know. I don't really, I really think that fits. Uh, but in, in almost any other situation, Purple and green is an amazing combo. Take notes, kids. Uh, write that down in your book of important shit to remember. You know what? Actually, right there with like the pinky kind of magenta-y color, kind of like right there, that doesn't look bad at all. Okay, if there's anything we've learned in some of the previous generations is that, is that they're uh, not afraid to take the main body color and change it around. So we won't be afraid either. It'll be okay, guys. Turn it down a little bit. Whoa. What if we made him like a black bunny? A black bunny, but let everything else stays the same. That's actually not bad. It actually doesn't look too bad. Uh, let's turn it down just a little bit. And then maybe now? Maybe now we can experiment with some of the colors. What if we went like green? <gasps> look, he's like a nuclear bunny. He's like radioactive. There we go. Remember what I told you earlier? That orange, that pur purple and green looks good together? Right there. That's where it looks fantastic. Look at that bun bun. It doesn't scream fire type, like, at all, but, but it looks cool. You know, actually, if you ask me, I think the second one is probably what they're most likely going to do. If you take the fact that Score Bunny is probably going to be some kind of soccer bunny, um, I don't know if you guys have ever seen this. I don't even watch sports and I've kind of noticed this that a lot of teams have like two different kinds of like jerseys or outfits or whatever. And they're the same colors as like they're the, the colors that represent their team. But like some of them are swapped around. And I think it's so that on the field they're easier to spot just in case like the, the opposing team's jerseys would like make it hard to see which team is which. I think... I think that's what they do. I'm pretty sure I've seen that. I don't, I'm not a sports guy, I wouldn't know. But if that's true, then, you know, swapping around what is the reddish orange and what is the yellowish orange or whatever on Score Bunny around for the shiny, that'd be pretty cool. I, I think that's probably the most likely as long as the soccer aesthetic with it is actually correct as like uh, what everyone's guessing. All right, keeping into the order in which these boys were revealed, we're just gonna go ahead and drag Drag this young lad right about, right about there. It'll be okay. And I don't think we need to do much in the realm of selecting. He's pretty blue. Uh, so we can probably just, uh, hue and saturation. 
and then just go by blues, dubas, dees, dubas, dies, and then uh, slide things around. Whoa! Oh, it only selected the the darkest blues. Hmm. Okay, give me a sec. All right, now that we have everything properly selected, we can finally slide things around. <gasps> I immediately, I immediately like purple. <laughs> that was not planned at all. Wow, that looks really good. A lot of people have been comparing this Pokemon to Mudkip, by the way. I think it's because they're both like aquatic, quadruped, finned things. I think that's the comparison they're making. So if they went with this like pinkish purple like they did with Mudkip, I wouldn't be too upset. I think more though, I would prefer something that goes into like the greens, kind of like what Piplup does. Like something like, something like uh, that right there. I really like that. Perfect. Just make it slightly more green. Just make the whole thing green. It is a chameleon. So like chameleons are typically green. Okay. I want to play around with the idea that they don't change the main body color too much. Like maybe uh, let's see, maybe into a lighter blue, maybe into a darker blue even, maybe just like slightly darker than normal, and then take all of the the darkest features of Sable, and then change those like completely. Yeah, no, the reds, the reds, while they look okay, I don't, mm, I don't know, I don't know if I like the combo. We'll experiment with a red idea later. I kind of dig like this in between. It's kind of between the yellow and the greens that I was playing because like there's the yellow and then there's the green. You go kind of in between. They don't actually look that bad if you're asking me. And then of course you gotta play, you gotta play around with the fin. The fin's gotta change a little bit. Orange, ah, okay, yeah. You know what, right there, I like the orange. I like the orange. Okay, so I do want to play around with a red idea. So let me grab all of this blue on this boy. Blew his house with a blue little window and a blue Corvette and everything is blue for him and himself and everybody around because he ain't got nobody to listen. I'm blue. Oh, he looks kind of cute actually. Oh, <laughs> right there. I like that. I like that a lot. What if that's all they did? What if they just took all the, all the blue and made a red instead? Fucking bars. I actually do like that quite a bit, but of course, of course, you gotta fuck with the fin. Always gotta fuck with the fin. But right there, with kind of like that sea foam. That's kind of like sea foam, green, aquamarine type color. That's not that bad. I don't think that's that bad. This next one might seem a little off the wall. I kind of have an idea of what I want to do. But if you watch my last video where I talked about what types these uh, these young lads might might become in the future, I totally missed the idea that because. Uh, Sable can like camouflage himself and like disappear essentially. What if he got the ghost typing? Which is super cool because ghost is one of my favorite types. Obviously, my name is my name is Spectre. My mascot is a ghost type. So like, you know that like I don't know why I didn't put that together. It's like a violety color because like once you get into purple, then it's a little too mudkip for me. So it's kind of ch stay kind of in the violet realm. I kind of like that. And look, look exactly what I told you. Purple and green, it goes together. The mouth, mouth looks weird because I just kind of dragged the saturation. I didn't select anything. So we might go back and fix that. All right, and there we go. Okay, so purple and green. What did I tell you? It looks amazing together. I don't know why. It reminds me of like slime, you know? Do I sound, I probably sound really stupid saying that, but it reminds me of slime. I don't know, man. All right, so out of these, I actually think that the uh, the first one and the last one are probably the two most likely as to what they would do with Sobble. The red, the red is fun. It's a fun idea. Do I think that they're gonna do it? Probably not. All right, so last but not least is the boy, the good boy, the saint, the blessing to this earth, Grookey. Let's go ahead and gap Gappy him over, give him a little drag there, eh? And, uh, all right. Okay, so because Grookey is, of course, a grass starter, you have to have that obligatory, just becomes a slightly darker green color. So let's go ahead and just drag it over, kind of bordering into blue, but not really. Like, right about there. But then you, like, turn the dark, or the, the, the lightness down just a little. And even though that coloration is bordering on 
fuck what's that movie with the superheroes kick ass he looks like he looks like kick ass right now actually he actually looks like kick ass if you make it just slightly more blue right there that's <laughs> that's kick ass he's even got the stick <laughs> Oh, I hope this is the one. I hope this is the one that they do. <laughs> Another thing that I wouldn't put past them to do is just making Grookey like autumn colors. So give me a minute. I'm going to work my magic. Okay, so now that we have that changed, uh, we got to change the snout, obviously. I wouldn't doubt it if they just went like with a red, kind of like that. That doesn't even look bad, really. None of that looks like a grass type, if you're asking me. But if they were to make the... Do, do the cut the route of orange then i think turning what was orange into red is probably the most likely and on top of that i think they would more than likely grab all of these all of this brown on him spare the stick because the stick is not actually part of his body and take those and just kind of make them a little darker oh no it's not working why is it not working there Right about there is probably where they do it. That doesn't even look too bad, honestly. A little odd, for sure. But in these later generations, they really do kind of go hog wild with these shinies, so you never know. Of course, now that we've got the obligatory grass shinies out of the way, I think it's time to get a little experimental, so I'm just gonna kind of drag around colors until something looks good. Yeah, like these, these like red and burgundy colors, that doesn't even look bad at all. That looks pretty good. I'd say right about Right about there. That like fuchsia doesn't even look that bad. Purple, purple starting to look a little weird. It kind of reminds me of like, you know that video of that kid in the back seat of the car with the makeup all over her face and she's like, that's what it reminds me of. Honestly, they don't even look that bad. If you're asking me, I keep saying that all fucking, all fucking video. That's all it's been. Really though, that really does not look all that bad. Maybe I'm just weird with the way that I like colors, but I feel like those those colors complement each other very well. And of course, you know it wouldn't be a Spectre video without a little bit of purple action. So let's go ahead and slide into the realm of the purple. That's a little better. That's a little better. Mm, yeah, right about there. Oh my god. How did I how did I forget to do this? No, 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 no. Unacceptable condition. And turn it down. Cause I really think that with the shiny they'll darken up the browns. That's what I think they'll do. I like the purple. I don't think they do that, but it at least it looks nice. What can I say, man? Really purple hairbrush. It doesn't look purple because of the webcam settings. Damn it. All right, let's just call this proof that maybe one, you shouldn't give me Photoshop, but two, that I'm really, really bad at non-scripted videos. So uh, let me know which one of these you like the most or whatever ideas you have. If you have a better idea for a shiny, you can edit one yourself and you can tweet it at me at Spectre. Um, and I don't need a hashtag like Callum does it cause I'm not famous enough to need it. So pff, take that Callum. Uh, anyway, yeah. If you have any ideas, go ahead and send them to me or at least just comment them down below. I'd appreciate it. Smash that like button, subscribe if you're new, and of course hit that bell. I forgot to say that last video. We have to say that now if we want to do well at all on YouTube. Smash the bell, smash the like, slash, smash subscribe, and smash uh, going over to my gaming channel, Pixelites, and uh, dropping a sub there. I really suck at this video thing.